What's up everybody? Omar here from Simple Fitness and I'm going to teach you how to get healthy and fit simply. First and foremost, I'm going to let you guys know that I want my videos to be really short and to the point because I hate having to watch a 10 minute video for one piece of information. And you can't just watch one video and be like, okay, that's it, that's what I want. You have to watch a couple of videos. So if each video is 10 minutes a piece, you're going to be there for a long time. Hopefully none of my videos should be over 5 minutes. I just want to get information to you guys simply. So that's the point of the channel, just quick, easy information, just what you want to know. A lot of people don't have motivation and that's something I don't really want to go over because if you want to better yourself, you should have the motivation to better yourself. So if you have trouble getting motivation, find a song that gets you pumped, find a video that gets you pumped, a TV show, a scene from a movie, anything. Just get going. As long as you're moving, as long as you're heading in the right direction, that's all you need. Don't eat anything too heavy before the gym because then your stomach's going to be in a lot of discomfort. So just eat something healthy like a banana and water, that's like everybody's favorite thing, just a banana and water. Um, it's light, it gives you energy, so I do recommend that. Um, maybe two hours beforehand you can eat like, you know, a sandwich or something like that. Something healthy, don't eat any like cake or Chinese food, because that will slow you down. Never eat Chinese food, ever. Unless, you know, that's, you know, your cheat day. So before you actually start training, know what you want to do. Working on arms, chest, back, legs. And how do you want to work it out? That is key information that you need to know. What you shouldn't do is focus on things like getting abs or being stronger. Just focus on getting better and working out and everything else will follow. So don't focus on the little mediocre things. Just focus on what you need to do. A lot of people say you do three sets of 10. I do three sets of 12 because 15 reps is for endurance, and about 8 reps is for strength. So I go for something right in the middle, that way I'm optimally working my muscles for strength and endurance. It doesn't really work that way, but it makes me feel better. So I usually do 3 sets of 12 with whatever I'm doing, and even if I can't finish it, I always just try to finish it. So if I'm curling, and I get to 10, and I can't get to 12, I'll drop it for 2 seconds, take a breather, pick it right back up, no more than 10 seconds, and finish my set. Try not to work out for more than two hours at a time because that's just overkill. You can do it, you know, going to the gym for three hours is pretty fun, but it's not needed. So, from an hour to two hours. If you're working out for half an hour, I don't know what you're doing. You should be working out a little bit longer. Um, if you find you can't do anything else, do some cardio. You can never do too much cardio, unless you're in bulking season. I like calisthenics personally because it stays with you longer. For example, if you lift 300 pounds in a bench press, then don't work out for a week, and then try to do 300 pounds again, that's not going to happen. But if you can do 100 push-ups, and you don't work out for a week, if you try to do 100 push-ups again, you can probably get it. Or maybe 90. So, it's actually a lot better for you. It supports lean muscle mass, which is what everybody wants. Muscle mass without fat. So, I recommend doing calisthenics. Because also, you want to be able to do some cool things, you know? The cool things! Make sure you stretch before and after your workout. Nobody wants to be inflexible. And the more you don't stretch, the more you start looking like this everywhere you go. So, I recommend stretching before and after. If you stretch beforehand, it minimizes injury. If you stretch afterwards, it helps you recover. So, stretching is always a good thing. The only one way to get you the body of your dreams, the only surefire way, is one thing. Dedication. If you stop for a week, that is not dedication. You will not get to where you want to be. If you're going to take a break, Take no more than a two-day break. It depends on what your goals are and it depends on who you are. But if you're a young person who has nothing wrong with them and you want to get fit, then dedicate yourself to getting fit. The more you dedicate yourself, the easier it will be and the faster your results will come. And after your workout, your body needs protein. You just broke down your body and it's made of protein. So just get a lot of protein in within the first hour of your workout. The faster you do it, the better it will be. So just and take something that's high in protein like you know beef, chicken, turkey, eggs, peanuts, there's a lot of things that have protein so just kind of search up what has protein, what doesn't, or a protein bar and you should be set. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you liked my first video, 
Don't worry, I will go into more detail on other topics and I will make videos upon request. So make sure you like, subscribe, and share, and I'll make sure that you get fit. Simply.